Russia is the fourth largest generator and consumer of electricity in the world. Its 440 power stations have a combined installed generation capacity of 220 gigawatts. The Russian electric grid links over 3,200,000 kilometers, 2 million miles of power lines, 150,000 kilometers, 93,000 miles of which are high voltage cables over 220 kilovolts. Electricity generation is based largely on gas 46%, coal 18%, hydro 18%, and nuclear 17% power. 60% of thermal generation gas and coal is from combined heat and power plants. Russia operates 31 nuclear power reactors in 10 locations, with an installed capacity of 21 gigawatts. Despite considerable geothermal, wind, and wave resources, renewable energy production accounts for less than 1%. Topic: <laughs> History. The electric power industry has been a state monopoly since Soviet times. After the collapse of the Soviet Union Unified Energy System of Russia Rao UES was founded as state-owned company. From 1992 to 2008 it was the largest electric power holding company. Four energy companies, Novosibirskenergo, Tatanergo, Irkutskenergo and Bashanergo, managed to avoid incorporation into Rao UES. Topic: Privatization and reform. In 2002, the Russian government began reforming the power sector. The main goal was and remains upgrading the aging and outdated heating and electricity infrastructure. The restructuring involved the separation and privatization of the generation, transmission, and sales companies. The grids were brought under regulatory supervision. Power generation was divided up into seven wholesale generating companies (OGK), including Rushidro, 14 territorial generating companies (TGK), independents, and state-owned entities. OGKs contain power plants and specialize mainly in electric power generation. TGKs contain predominantly combined heat and power plants CHPs. .The gradual liberalization of the wholesale electricity market, completed in January 2011, now allows producers to charge market prices. The transmission grid remains mostly under state control. As a result of the reorganization, Inter Rao UES became a major generating company in Russia in the field of export and import of electric power. The total installed capacity of the power plants owned or managed by the company is around 18,000 MW. The company's main types of activities are generation of electric and thermal power, sales of electric and thermal power to consumers and export and import of electric power. <laughs> Post-reform developments Price increase followed the reform process, three to four times the margin set by regulatory authorities. In November 2011, then Prime Minister Vladimir Putin tasked the Ministry for Economic Development Russia, the Ministry of Energy Russia, and the Federal Tariff Service to draft a government resolution restricting the profitability of electric utilities. This restricted the ability of electric utilities to make money from providing services other than supplying electricity." As of 2013, Russia had no wholesale electricity market. The Ministry for Energy of Russia, concerned with price increases envisions a wholesale market under bilateral contracts between consumers and specific power plants. Inter Rao and Gazprom Energy Holding were lobbying for a different one. Equipment producers Power Machines is the leading Russian equipment producer, with a share of over 50%. It unites production, supply, construction, maintenance and modernization of equipment for thermal, nuclear, hydraulic and gas turbine power plants. 
The following big international energy equipment holdings are well established and have joint ventures or their own production facilities in Russia General Electric, Siemens, Alstom, AB, Skoda Power, Mitsubishi Heavy Industries, Ansaldo Energia, and Areva. Power companies Topic: Territorial generating companies. TGK1 Northwest, Leningrad, Murmansk Oblasts and Karelia. TGK2 North of Central Russia, Vologda and Arkhangelsk Oblasts. Mosinergo, TGK3, Moscow and Moscow Oblast. Quadra TGK4, Black Earth and Southern Regions of Central Russia, 12 Oblasts in all. T Plus Group TGK5 Kirov Oblast, Udmusha, Mariel and Chavashir TGK6 East of Central Russia, Penza Oblast TGK7 Middle Volga and Orenburg Oblast TGK9 Perm Krai, Sverdlovsk Oblast and Komi Republic Lukoil Ecoenergo TGK8, Southern Federal District Fortum TGK10 Urals Federal District except for Sverdlovsk Oblast TGK11 Omsk and Tomsk Oblast Siberian Generation Company Kuzbasenergo TGK12 Kemerovo Oblast and Altai Krai Yenisei Territorial Generation Company TGK13 Krasnyarsk Krai Karkasia and Tiva TGK-14 Beriatia and the Trans-Baikal Krai Wholesale generating and other companies Inter-Rao OGK-1 merged into Inter-Rao in 2012 OGK-3 merged into Inter-Rao in 2012 OGK-2 OGK6 merged into OGK2 in 2010. Unipro OGK4. Enel Russia OGK5. Irkutskenergo, independent vertically integrated company. It owns the production and distribution facilities supplying the Irkutsk region. Rushidro, excluded from the 2003 reform law as it is considered a strategic asset. Rosenergo Atom, state-owned company controlling all nuclear power generation assets. Topic: Transmission and distribution companies. Rosetti, MOESK, Moscow Metropolitan Area. FGCUES. Topic: Supply companies. Largest supply companies: OJSC First Supply Company, OJSC Saint Petersburg Supply Company, OJSC Samara Energo, OJSC EK Vostok. Topic: Isolated energy systems. Some parts of the country have limited connections to the Russian Unified Energy System, reducing the likelihood that new companies will enter the energy supply market by importing energy from neighboring energy systems. Those areas, defined as non-price zones, include Kaliningrad Oblast, the Komi Republic, Arkhangelsk Oblast, the south of the Saka Republic, Primorsk Krai, Khabarovsk Krai, Amur Oblast, and the Jewish Autonomous Oblast. Additionally, some parts of Russia are completely isolated from the unified energy system, including Kamchatka, Magadan Oblast, Sakhalin Oblast, Chukotka and Taimir Autonomous Okrig, the western and central parts of the Saka Republic, as well as many remote settlements across the country. Energy prices in non price and isolated regions are exempt from liberalization and remain regulated. Consumption 
In 2008 the end use of electricity was 4.3% 726 terawatt hours of the world total 16819 terawatt hours. In 2008 the gross production of electricity was 5.1% 1038 terawatt hours of the world total 20181 terawatt hours. Topic Mode of production According to the IEA the Russian gross production of electricity was 1,038 terawatt-hours in 2008 and 930 terawatt-hours in 2004 giving the fourth top position among the world producers in 2008. Top 10 countries produced 67% of electricity in 2008. The top producers were, 1. United States 21.5% 2 China 17.1% 3 Japan 5.3% 4 Russia 5.1% 5 India 4.1% 6 Canada 3.2% 7 Germany 3.1% 8 France 2.8% 9 Brazil 2.3% and 10 South Korea 2.2% The rest of the world produced 33%. topic gas The share of natural gas fueled electricity was 48% of the gross electricity production in 2008 in Russia 495 terawatt hours 1038 terawatt hours topic coal and peat The share of coal and peat electricity was 19% of the gross electricity production in 2008 in Russia, 187 terawatt hours, 1038 terawatt hours. Topic: <inaudible> Nuclear power. In 2008 Russian Federation was the fourth country by nuclear electricity production with 163 terawatt hours 6% of the world total According to the IEA 15.7% of Russian domestic electricity was generated by nuclear power in 2008 in 2009 Russia had in total 31 nuclear reactors and installed capacity in 2008 23 GW Topic: Nuclear reactor construction and export. In 2006, Russia had exported nuclear reactors to Armenia, Bulgaria, Czech Republic, Finland, Hungary, India, Iran, Lithuania, Slovak Republic, and Ukraine. In Russia, the average construction time was in one 1965 to 1976 57 months and two 1977 to 1993 72 to 89 months, but the four plants that have been completed since then have taken around 180 months 15 years, due to increased opposition following the Chernobyl accident and the political changes after 1992. topic hydropower In 2008 hydroelectricity generated 167 terawatt hours from a total capacity of 47 gigawatts The country is the fifth largest producer of electricity from hydropower in the world accounting for 5.1% of the world's hydroelectric generation the use of other renewable sources for electricity in 2008 was not significant in Russian Federation according to the statistics of IEA in terms of electricity volume in 2008. Electricity imports As of 2010, Russia imports 17.5% of its total electricity consumption, with about 90% originating from Kazakhstan and Georgia. Inter Rao has a monopoly on electricity imports in the country. <laughs> Power stations <laughs> <laughs> 
Topic: <laughs> Kyoto Carbon Allowances. The revenues from Kyoto allowances via joint implementation project sales can be significant, in the billions of euros in the cases of Russia. If a number of relatively strict criteria were filled G projects could be implemented during the Kyoto Protocol Agreement, for which no international third-party checking or UN approval was needed. According to Transparency International a lack of regulation in carbon trading poses the risk of fraud. In 2009 it was not in all cases clear which government organizations had the authority to sell the surplus and how transparently and accountably such transfers of public wealth were carried out. See also IPS, UPS, the Unified Energy System of Russia and other former Soviet countries Energy in Russia Energy policy of Russia Electric energy markets by country